so yesterday I uploaded a video called "This Man Helped His Girl Find a This This Guy Helped His Ex Find a New Man." This video is the same exact thing, but in reverse. She helps him find a shorty. I'm just curious if she picks the right shorty. I don't believe she is. I think she's toxic. But they claim they're not in the video, so I'll, I'll reserve my judgment. But I'm going to tell you right now, as a woman, you just let your man go. You was never the one. That's all I'm going to say. So look, if you're new, subscribe. It's free. Like the video. Let's get it straight into it. You're gorgeous. You're just really tall. I'm Damn, sorry. Just <laughs> 15 versus 2. I'm Did she get 15 options? I, I can't remember. Gabri. I'm Dennis. She's, She's so my ex-boyfriend. Ex-girlfriend. <laughs> we dated for about over, two years. Over, over two, two years. years. Two years and a half. Over two years. <laughs> Broken up for like two months. Do you guys feel like you've both like moved on from the relationship? I have. Yeah, I think I have too. He only said he moved on because she moved on. That nigga want her back. I'll be feeding to get her back, bro. Me personally, I couldn't go for that. What was that? <laughs> um, Dennis is like on the quiet side. So I would say his type is definitely someone who's like a little bit more outgoing. She has to like no music probably and dress well. And he needs someone with like a lot of personality, I feel like. That nigga did seem boring when he was talking to all the men. But even then, I still want to let... I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm not about to be sending my girl out here to be licking no meat that ain't mine. I ain't going for it. I promise you, I won't be going for it. My heart. She still has love for him. That's adorable. You still love me, we shouldn't be broken up. That's all I'm gonna say. Look, if you still like me, let me know. We can make things work. You know what I'm saying? What, what is the problem? Y'all just grew apart, let's grow back together. Hey, me and my relationship, hey, if I ever get married, we're one. Me and my girl move as a unit. You know what I'm saying? Why are y'all not moving as a unit? Y'all clearly still have something for each other. You see how concerned she was? I, I'll tell you who I like already. Look here, partner. You right here. I need her. I'm A. What is her name? I want her. She is fine. Who is this? At least she's not picking nobody ugly. You're so pretty. <laughs> I'm glad she not doing... Okay, so maybe she isn't toxic. Personally, I wouldn't let my man go away if I was her. You know what I'm saying? A. Once we locked in, we locked in. Me personally. I ain't going for it. I did not date you for two years for you to just move on like the way you guys are. I wouldn't go for that. Anything over a year is dangerous. You're not going to have my heart for a year and think you're just going to get away. It's not happening. Mm, look at this. That is a tall you're gorgeous. Woman, you're really tall. tall. I'm sorry. <laughs> I climbed tree. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? I, I'll climb that tree. She's too again. I like shorts right here. Both of these shorts are kind of cute. No cap. I love your makeup. Good energy. I'm obsessed with your hair. <laughs> She's like, <my God. laughs> I'm glad she ain't turn away the baddest one in the group, cause I that'd be some hating ass shit. I'm glad. I'm glad she knows that she can move on and not feel threatened by a new woman. I'm glad. Personally, I still wouldn't go for this. <laughs> Anything over years, it, no. I'm not helping you figure out shit. Figure it out yourself. You don't want to be with me. You can figure it out. Dude, I'm sweating. Friend. It's hot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm chilling. Hi. Hello. I'm Liz. The first thing I noticed was your Crocs. Oh my god. <laughs> I, no, I love them. Oh, thank you. What's your name? My name's Gabrielle. That's awkward. No, thank you. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> I don't even like her voice. I'm sorry. No, thank you. I think I know who he likes. I hope he has the same taste as me. I'll let him be upset. What's your name? My name is Gabriella, but I go by Gabri. Allison. My name is Brianna, but I go by Rhea. I know her. <laughs> That's crazy. Did you recognize me when you were all right away? I was like in the back, so we like play soccer together. Are you nervous? At That's all? crazy. So nervous. What are the chances of you getting hired on the same set as somebody you met a long time ago? That that's like a slim to none chance. That's crazy. 
I don't think she's gonna give her the chance though, because she knows her. I think I think that she's gonna like make sure that she doesn't get a chance because she knows her. I think it hurts less when you don't know the person. <laughs> He's nervous too. Yeah. <laughs> How is this like interaction right now? I saw you guys like all lovey dovey on Instagram. <laughs> so, like kind of awkward. Yeah. I feel like it's We're cool. Like anymore. I feel like a lot of people can't imagine being in the same space as their ex. Um, Me personally, I have no problem being in the same space as my ex. You know what I'm saying? It's all love. I don't ever spread negativity. You know what I'm saying? I'm not a toxic person. I'm like, the only person I hate, actually, I can't even say her name, but I hate that motherfucker. She was dumb. Like, I, no thank you. But anyway, um, but me, I don't, I don't, like, if you broke up with me or I broke up with you, it shouldn't be no hard feeling unless, like, you said some really toxic shit to me or you're being toxic. I only, I only act negative around the people that have hurt me when they're being negative. You know what I mean? Like, there's no, like, bro. If you hurt my feelings, cool, I'm over it. You know what I mean? But don't be trying to, like, do too much. Like, you did what you did. Let's keep it pushing. I'll be cordial when I see you. I don't hate you. Like, you did what you spoke. You did, you did what you felt. Anyway, but, um, I don't even know what I was saying. I just wanted I just wanted a reason to talk. <laughs> oh, oh, she said she didn't, couldn't imagine being the, I don't want to be around my ex too long. I'll be cordial when I see you, but after, like, 10 minutes, go away. <laughs> What do you do right now? I go to UCLA and I Ooh. study design media arts. So I'm doing like oh. graphic design, um, web design, <laughs> things like that. He's a graphic designer. That's so major. cool. I did recently switch though. So yeah. fourth year in college, but barely starting graphic design. So I actually make wigs. Oh, um, nice. Yes. No. And I'm really into fashion. I, I love fashion. <laughs> every every yeah, girl says she's a nail tech is trash. Oh, but that's I'm, dope. Like, I don't know. I'm always nervous. Like no one's gonna... Don't ever date a nail tech or a chick who sells wigs. They're not trustworthy. No, thank you. No, thank you. They give off bad vibes. I've talked to a guy. No, no. Like no, I'm you should just do it. There's so many different people in the world. You That's know, true. somebody's gonna like it. That's true. What do you listen to? Like top three or top five? Okay, top three. I like Chance her. The rapper. What do you listen? to? Chance the rapper. Ew. Then... Chance and Kanye. This nigga sucks. Oh my god. I was just about to get my nigga the benefit of the doubt. He got her. I hope he gets the worst one in the group. <laughs> Fucking Chance the rapper. That nigga's mid. And I think I'm oh, What? Is music like a bit. Okay. All right. That's enough. <laughs> Big thing for you. Like, if I find out someone's music taste, it can tell me a lot about themselves. Who are your top three? The Weeknd, always. Yes. Mac Miller and Kanye. I have a Mac Miller tattoo. Are you serious? Yes, it's Divine <laughs> Feminine right here, yeah. Oh my god. Wait. It's making you want to I think so. <laughs> <laughs> If you were to see Dennis on a dating app, would it have been? If you listen, if you listen to the weekend, you are. Hey, that's a green flag to me. I love the weekend. You know what I'm saying? We get, we get. Listen, my favorite the weekend album is um, what's it called? My dear melancholy. She has your soul, bro. You know what I'm saying? But that's just because a lot of women just do me wrong for no reason. I don't need to be doing nothing. Like I'm a very good man. You know what I'm saying? I, I I'm very much a lover, and every time I try to love, I get hurt. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Real talk. Fuck you. <laughs> like, why do y'all do that to me? Y'all yeah, yeah, ask for it, and then when I give it to you, you take it away. Like, why? why? A left or a right, be honest. Like, pretend um, like he's not here. I'm not sure. <laughs> it depends on the profile. I need some that more like, no. information. I would have probably gone right. You know, it mostly de depend on like our conversation. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> have you been single for a while? I only broke up like two or three. Two months Bro, ago. she talks like the other guy from the other video. I just turned my mic off. You know what I'm saying? You know, I was hanging out with this one guy. He was kind of cool. Like, speak up. Say it with your chest. We were going in different directions and said bye. <laughs> I got out of a two-year relationship in March. Um, I actually ended it just because I didn't want to do the long distance anymore. It was a very like complicated relationship, so it most of the time felt like I was alone. So oh, I would just say girl, it was already. I get it. You get it. Yeah. <laughs> it was bound to end. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, I feel it that. Was bound to crash. Red flag, off the top of your head, like I want to be able to have my own space, do my own thing, and not have, I guess, like my partner be clingy all the time. Okay, I have no problem with that. I'm a clingy man. I have no problem saying I'm very clingy. Like, if I like you, I want to be around you. No cap. Like, let's. I, I don't just just be around. You know what I'm saying? If I like you, like, let's hang out. Like, like more. It, okay, you want your space? You get like three days out the week. That's your space. The other four days, I expect some type of communication. 
whether we're hanging out or you call me. I will prefer if you just call me. Like, if you don't want to hang out, just call me. Like, when I'm recording videos or whatever, I'll put you, I'll put my shit on mute so it's not, you know what I'm saying? So I'm not saying nothing to Facebook towards you while I'm recording. Like, I have not, like, I, I really, do, I can try to make it work. You know what I'm saying? I'm, the more I do these these Jubilee videos, the more I expose myself. I don't know if I if I like telling y'all this. Y'all niggas gonna hurt me, man. I don't like to. I'll be giving y'all the business. <laughs> like, do y'all like this? Like, me being this personal? <laughs> Comment W or L. I feel that too. 100%. <laughs> I wasn't clingy. Right? I just wanted to say that, okay? It wasn't me. <laughs> Ideal partner. What are, like, what are some qualities that you look for? Someone who reads. And someone who's fun. Adventurous. Okay. You like, want outgoing, I don't want... social. Yeah. Their ambition matters a lot to me. Like, if you have a goal... She's a, like, I like her. She's not the prettiest in the room, but she got the most goals. You know what I'm saying? Like, she knows what she wants. I need more women to get self aware as this. She knows exactly what she's looking for. Every time a girl talks to me, she'll know what she's looking for. Then will ask me to do certain things, and then will and then will act like she don't want it. Why are you doing that? Stop wasting my time. I like her. She's cool. She's not the prettiest, but like she not like she she knows she's self aware. That's number one on the list. Outside of being fine. If you have a passion, that's kind of like what I get attracted towards. You want someone who's close to their family? Yeah, or? definitely. I would want someone who's good with their parents. I'm really good with I don't like the way moms. she talks. Like, like I don't like her voice. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. All right, it was nice meeting you. Beautiful. And bye. Have a good one. I'm beautiful and you're bye. <laughs> it was nice meeting you. Thank you. Am I going this way? Okay. Bro, loosen up. I'm trying. I don't know. I can't find a time to go in because you just keep going. Oh, sorry. Don't take away the fine ones, bro. Okay, sounds good. Um, red hair, yes. W. <laughs> One next to you, yes. W. I'm fine. Pick the black girl. Why should she pick? Oh, you notice how she picked the most mid women in the group? Yo, she's hating right now. Real talk. Like, oh my god. There's no. I know that they got along the most, but the nigga went went. When you had a conversation and y'all asked questions for you, he didn't pick nobody mid. Like, damn, asshole. Like, that's crazy. See how women do you? <laughs> Is it? I, I I knew that I knew there was something about her, bro. I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice meeting you guys. Bye. Him. He's kind of I don't know how Dennis got her, her, bro. She is so far. There's no <laughs> just way. Just a, a lot of breaking it down. <laughs> Especially that nigga don't even sound like he talk a lot. Here, remind me your name again. Allison. Allison. Okay, yeah. Allison. Right off the bat, what are your reservations of, like about Dennis, like from what you observed? I felt like I spoke more to you than I spoke to him, but yeah. I mean, it is a very new environment, so I don't think it's his fault. <laughs> Did you say that you would swipe left or right on him? I don't think he's my normal type, so I think if I just saw him like on Tinder, probably a left. Probably a left? If he <laughs> yeah. Is, fine. It was Ri? Like, Ria. 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 Yeah. Dennis does tend to have like close relationships with female friends. How yeah. do you feel about that? Um, it just depends. I mean, there's one side of me that is definitely still a work in progress as far as insecurity, so maybe I wouldn't be all about it, but mm -hmm. I think that with, with time, I've learned to be wiser. Do you look for a partner who's like gonna provide affirmations in your relationship? This is such a boring conversation. Ask him about the sex. That's all I'm worried about, you know what I'm saying? How the box, how the box moving. You know what I'm saying? If this sex is great, I'll tolerate a lot. <laughs> Let me relax. I'm such an asshole. But real talk, I don't care. I like her tap. What is that on her hand? That's cool. And a little eye on the arm. Bro, she is so gorgeous. <laughs> I need to get in contact with her somehow. I'm going to LA. I feel like that's more on me, but okay. it would it wouldn't hurt to hear like some feedback. Mm -hmm. But my definitely priorities that's something that is more of like a, a self. <laughs> Every time I expose myself to y'all, the more I realize I have some crazy priorities. <laughs> I just sat here and said she's boring because they're not talking about sex. And ain't nobody gonna say nothing about it in the comments. <laughs> Bro, y'all niggas, <laughs> y'all should be letting me get that shit off. Journey, because I feel like if I can't give it to myself. So you're more committed to like self love rather yes. than like, okay, yes, okay, definitely. okay. I feel like we're going on a date. I know, right? <laughs> I was like, I'm nervous. <laughs> you saw Dennis. 
Yeah. Sandy like, is a nasty name, like, no cap. Pretty fine, you know what I mean? Oh, I was like, fine? No. Or like, <laughs> just like, fine. Like, I would like to talk to him more, okay. but if I'm being totally honest, he is, like, he just, like, switched his major and stuff, so he is kind of in that phase of figuring stuff out. Is that something that kind of, like, you wouldn't want to be involved with, in a no, sense? No, actually funny, because, like, I switched my major at my oh, college okay. recently, so yeah. I was like, oh my god, am I behind in life? Okay. But no, no, no. If you're no lazy and you just don't have any ambition page. to do anything, then that's when it's, like, a red flag for me. Okay. But switching major, still figuring things out, he's still young, I'm still young, and, like, I think every day we have something we can I do. like her, bro. She is very, like, mature. How many... Uh, what? That's so... Bro, oh, oh, I know so many immature women, bro. I swear to you, like, why is she so, she's very self-aware, she understands, people are people. I do too, I like her. I like her personality. She's cool. Why can't more girls be like that? <laughs> Improve on to mature ourselves, and like, he's on like, his own journey Like, trying to too. figure shit out, like, I'm trying to get this shit off the ground, bro. I feel like people expect way too much. So it just, I have no right to be like, Oh my god, Can you so speed it up a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Nice to talking to you. Oh. Yeah, I feel like I know someone who's like a good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's the I know. Redhead. And I think he gonna pick. He would have picked the redhead too. Well, actually, I would have picked the light skinned chick. But I think he would have picked the redhead too. Hello. <laughs> what's Hello. What's up? What's up? I like your pants, by the way. Thank you. I like. It's like stylish. I like, I like your style. Are you into style? Everything. Yes, I am. Very. <gasps> really? In I my Instagram, can't... I'll show you it. Literally, Personally, show yeah. because that's like my biggest thing right now. I'm like trying to up my game. I wear a lot. She of gonna steal your swag and then dump it. Of... That's what hoes do. I'm not saying she's a hoe, but look, girls will be all in your phone doing that and the third, steal one, you, steal your drip, and then run off, move around. You're not. Hey, you gotta go back to being lame, my nigga, once we're not talking. You know what I'm saying? Don't try to take my shit. I never asked, like, but why did you and Gabri break up? So we broke up twice, actually. Uh, the first it time... Happens. Yeah, I don't know. Well, it was my first, like, long relationship. Okay. So I was, like, I went in kind of blind. I feel like she taught me a lot of things. and then. But, yeah, I think we broke up because I felt like I was, we were always with each other and we didn't know how to balance stuff out. So I've only been in one long relationship and it was for like a little more than a year. And for me, it was literally the same issue. Like we were together so often and then we kind of just created like a codependency with each other, which I really just could not do. What would your choice have been? I chose you. Like Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. oh, W you chose her, W. I would pick the last kid chick personally. That's basically the end of this video though. Look here, I'm gonna tell you, why is my mic on in the camera? Hey, look, real talk. Don't don't participate in this buffoonery. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What the hell? I would never in my life allow any of this, especially we've been together for more than a year. You're gonna have to figure that shit out yourself. Don't try to pick out somebody for me. Matter of fact, if you dump me after a year and we don't get back together within that month, say goodbye, my nigga. We ain't talking no more. <laughs> you got to go. You know what I'm saying? There's no way you loved me for a year and then ran away. I refuse. Maybe I'm just jaded. I am very much like pessimistic on women, but that's besides the point. You know what I'm saying? If you enjoyed this video, smash that like button, subscribe, uh, uh, leave a comment, say anything. Comment, wiggity whack. I don't know. Look, catch y'all later. <laughs>